Coming up, Mixie the Rabbit introduces our entertaining morning of children's programs, beginning with Albert the Fifth Musketeer, then Pablo the Little Red Fox and Teletubbies. Following a story about the forgotten toys, the animals pretend to be each other on Magic Mountain before Thomas the Tank Engine. Then we visit Sesame Street and Kitto and Woofle before all the fun of play school. Enjoy your morning with ABC. Our education programs begin this morning with a look at the stages of building a house on For the Juniors before Our Animals examines emus. Here's The Beat encourages musical appreciation, then Geographical Eye over Africa studies Nigeria. Japan 2000 looks at the survival of the rural economy before Place and People visits the Amazon rainforest, followed by The Living Landscape. Enjoy your viewing on ABC. Coming up, the latest news in World at Noon. Then Quantum examines the use of honey as a replacement for antibiotics. At one o'clock, Landline reports on the country campus of a Melbourne school educating the carers of the future environment. Then Vincent identifies Wilger's murderer on Heartland. Our children's programs begin at three o'clock this afternoon with the Tweenies. Enjoy your viewing on ABC. Tonight at 8, it's better than the torch, really. Bigger than the opening ceremony. John! Oh, God, here we go. It's the final episode of The Games. You people have really surpassed yourselves this time. What are you talking about? What's that supposed to mean? Miss it, and you'll regret it for the rest of your life. But it wasn't our fault, Nick. This is a catastrophe. I mean, there isn't anything bigger you could cock up. I repeat, up. it wasn't our fault. The Games, tonight at 8. And don't forget the best of The Games, Monday to Thursday at 6. Following the Games, Four Corners investigates the efforts to keep the Sydney Olympics drug-free before Media Watch. Then it's comedy at its most topical on Backburner before the sporting comedy of The Fat and Late Line. Tonight on ABC.